so good morning to one and all so this class we are going to see about this uh, demultiplexer so last class we discussed multiplexer so demultiplexer is a reverse operation of the multiplexer demultiplexer performs a reverse operation of a multiplexer that is it receives one input and distribute it over several outputs so in the case of multiplexer we have many inputs and it produces one output so in the case of demus we have only one input and produce several outputs that is reverse operation of the demultiplexer multiplexer diagram shows the b multiplexer that is 1 is to 2 power n that is 1 is to 4 so here we are having two selection lines s0 and s1 number of inputs 1 selection lines 2 number of outputs 4 and design procedure and gates are used to represents the input and not gates represent the complement dot gate to produce the output so this slide shows the for d multiplexer that is 1 into 4 d multiplexer so here number of inputs 1 number of outputs 4 number of selection line two. so we have two selection lines s0 and s1 so we have four combination 0 0 0 1 1 0 1 1 and the output is o0 o1 o2 o3 if 0 0 means the o0 bit will be 1 the remaining will be 0 similarly 0 1 means the o1 bit will be 1 the remaining bits are 0 One zero means O two will be one. That will be high. The remaining bits are zero. Last one 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 means O four will be one. The remaining bits are zero. So this is a two table. So this is large diagram. D multiplexer one into four. So here is zero S one of the inputs. And data is a only one input. A zero is one of the two selection lines, and O zero, O one, O two, O three. These are the outputs. Suppose we are going to design one is to a D multiplexer. So how many selection lines are there? Three. A zero, S one, S two. So from zero 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 line to one one one. S zero, S one, S two. From zero zero to one one one. The output will be O zero to O seven. So if it is the selection line is zero zero means the output O zero will be one. The remaining will be zero. Similarly, have to calculate one 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 means the O seven will be one. The remaining bits are zero. So you have to calculate all the outputs. Finally, we design the logic diagram. Here we are having. Suppose if it is one is to eight means d multiplexer means s zero s one s two are the selection lines, and d um, there is only one data that is input o zero from o seven output. So this is the 
this is a demultiplexer and this slide shows the logic diagram for demultiplexer that is 1 into 4 demultiplexer there is only one data that is input so that it will be given to the AND gate selection lines is 0 S1 that will be given to the corresponding AND gate for inputs the AND gate output will be O0, O1, O2, O3 so that will be the outputs for D multiplexer there is only one input it produces several outputs suppose if it is 1 into 8 D multiplexer means how to draw the logic diagram you have a three selection lines S0, S1, S2 and there is only one data there is one input that will be given to the corresponding gauge for input the selection lines also will be given to the corresponding gauge for input. So instead of 4, we have used 8 AND gates and the AND gates output will be O0, O1 up to O8 that is 8 outputs. So this is a 8 is to 1 demultiplexer. So, this is an encoder circuit. So, an encoder is a device. Circuit, software program, algorithm, or person that converts information from one format or code to another. The purpose of encoder is standardization, speed, secrecy, security or saving space by shrinking size. If a device output code has fewer bit than the input code has, device is usually called an encoder. So number of inputs to power n, number of outputs n. So here there is no selection lines, only input and output. So this block shows the encoder block diagram. So here we are having two power n, n inputs and n outputs. So this is a 8 into 3 encoder, that is superiority encoder, optal to binary encoder. So this truth table shows the optal to binary encoder. Here input is 0 from 7, so the base of the optal is 8, 0 to 7, totally 8. So the output will be 1, uh, 3, A, B, C. 0 means the output is 0, 0, 0, 1 means 0, 0, 1. 7 means 1, 1, 1. So here we are giving the input 0 from 7. It will produce the 3 output A, B, C. So from the truth table we can take the K map A which is equal to summation M 4, 5, 6, 7. B which is equal to summation M 2, 3, 6, 7. C which is equal to summation M 1, 3, 5, 7. Okay. So, we have a 8 input 0 to 7. So, from that A which is equal to 4, 5, 6, 7 means we can take the 4th line to 6, 7. So, that will be given to the input of the A. For B means we can take 2, 3, 6, 7 as a input. So that will be given to the R gate, it will produce the output B. 
simply C. So this is the 8 into 3 encoder logic diagram.